My name is Kevin McCluskey. I'm president of King's Hammer Soccer LLC. So it was important for us at, at King's Hammer as we look to continue to improve, uh, to, to grow through the next kind of phases uh, of us as an organization, uh, to provide you know the soccer product to all of our people, all of the, the communities that we service. Um, we had to look at the entire ecosystem to really affect that. So having a national technical director that's focused, you know, primarily just on that ecosystem was, was important. But there's a lot of, you know, discussions and, and behind the scenes conversations that we've talked about, you know, how do we improve refereeing? How do we improve coaches development? How do we improve the opportunities for our players? How do we improve uh, education essentially and feedback to our parents? and looking at the ecosystem and having a person essentially to spend all of their time just to, to focus uh, on improving that uh, was an important thing for King Salmon. So as we continue to, to move forward uh, and we continue to develop and evolve, you know, we're also a organization that wants to invest in the future. And so this was a big investment and a big reason why we hired this position. First off, I, I think looking for the position as well, right? looking at the characteristics of what would uh, be able to drive home our philosophy, what would work with it, the team that we've built here at King Summer, those are all important things. We actually had a very extensive search as we went through, uh, had a chance to interview a lot of uh, very qualified and experienced candidates. Uh, but for Bronson, it, it stood out quite early, kind of in the process, um, that he understood the philosophy. Um, that he understood kind of what we were trying to achieve uh, as a club, understood the importance of product and, and development as a product, um, and showed a plan to be able to execute those things. So the more that we talked with Bronson, uh, the more details we, we kind of uncovered within his plan, uh, the more this made sense, and, and we were very confident that he was the right person for the position. Well, the big thing, of course, is consistency, right? Looking at the product that we want to deliver, and um, the curriculums that we've built out, the game model, uh, all of the resources that we've created over the last set of years, obviously for our, our coaches and our professional staff to develop and affect teams. And um, the biggest thing for him is, is to be able to tie that together, to be able to work with the leaders uh, in each of our regions, uh, all of our directors to coach him within our programs, um, to be able to interact essentially with every stakeholder within that ecosystem. So players, parents, coaches, directors of coaching, uh, and executive staff too. And with that approach, you know, Bronson, uh, we feel like has the personality uh, to be able to, you know, be a people person, first and foremost. Um, he's very well educated. Uh, he's an excellent communicator too. So we're confident that he can bring those parties together and, and walk uh, in a cohesive direction. Well, it's important again to, to be able to bring things to life, right? We have a curriculum, we have a game model, uh, we have, of course, expectations, we have standards. Uh, a big thing as far as, and a big responsibility for this position is, is to hold a lot of our staff accountable, right? In a good way, right? To, to push them to be better and, and to work with them to improve. And with that, um, we feel like that will certainly drive the, the product. We, we feel for our players and, and for our teams, they deserve uh, to have a high level product and, and high level expectations and standards. Uh, but for our staff as well, you know, we are a club that wants our people to grow, right? And, and that provides a different opportunity, uh, an education background that will support them. Um, and with kind of the, the vision that we have for the position and the personality and the skill sets that, that Bronson possesses, uh, we feel like we can benefit and elevate things on and off the field. Well, a big thing too with the national technical director coming in is, is to help the other leaders within regions. Um, at times, you know, our, our regional leadership, be it a director, a coach, and a GM or an executive director, of course, have a lot on their plate. And, and so for us, this, this was a big investment um, to be able to have a person that's just solely focused on product development, uh, that can help directly to the coach, to the parent, to the player, uh, but also then help that director and that professional within that region. So taking some things off their plate, being uh, super focused essentially on the development piece itself and being able to work with them to create feedback loops. Obviously, we, we spend a lot of time on surveys uh, trying to get as much information from you know, our, our consumer who's our player, but also our customer who are the parents, uh, as well as our professional staff. So with that type of kind of approach, we, we feel like this will be successful in helping all of those stakeholders and hopefully drive better service and better development.